The eyes that saw creation, the eyes that have witnessed creation for centuries. For as long as we've existed, humanity has looked up at the night sky in wonder, believing we understood its vastness. We traced patterns across the heavens, connecting the dots of distant suns into constellations that told our stories. We charted the stars, mapped the hidden galaxies, counted worlds far beyond our reach. And in doing so, we convinced ourselves that by naming them, by capturing their light through the lenses of our telescopes, we could somehow contain infinity within our grasp. But every time we thought we understood the cosmos, every time we believed we had reached its edge, reality shattered that illusion, reminding us how small we truly are. And now, once again, the James Webb Space Telescope has undone everything we thought we knew. Not with a whisper, but with a revelation so profound, it threatens to rewrite the very story of existence itself. With a single image, an image that reaches back across 13.5 billion years of cosmic history, Webb has forced us to confront a truth so vast, so beautiful, so incomprehensible, that it shakes the foundation of everything we thought was real. The universe is not just large. It is infinite in ways that our equations cannot express, our theories cannot define, and our imagination can barely comprehend. It is older than our science. Deeper than our philosophy. More structured than our dreams. And perhaps more alive than we ever dared to believe. What began as a mission to glimpse the faint afterglow of the Big Bang, has become something far more transcendent. Webb has not only revealed distant galaxies, it has illuminated the very architecture of creation itself. Before Webb, there was Hubble, humanity's great eye in the heavens. For over three decades, Hubble stood as our greatest window to the cosmos. Its ultra-deep field changed everything. In a patch of sky no larger than a grain of sand held at arm's length, Hubble revealed over 10,000 galaxies. Not stars, but entire universes unto themselves, each burning with billions of suns, each one a story billions of years in the making. That single image expanded our horizon, hinting that the observable universe might contain as many as two trillion galaxies. For a generation, Hubble defined what it meant to see beyond ourselves. It taught us that the night sky was not darkness but depth. And yet, even Hubble had limits. Its eyes could not see the oldest light, the light stretched thin by time itself, shifted into invisible wavelengths after eons of cosmic expansion. The James Webb Space Telescope was designed to pierce that veil. To look beyond time. To see the first dawn. The birth of stars. The moment when darkness first gave way to light. And when Webb's golden mirrors finally unfolded, and turned their gaze toward the heavens, the universe did not whisper back. It roared. One of Webb's most ambitious programs, Cosmos Webb, dedicated more than 250 hours to scanning what seemed to be an ordinary patch of sky, an area three times larger than the full moon. Thousands of exposures were captured, layered, and combined, creating the most intricate and breathtaking map of the universe ever made. Within that single image, scientists found something extraordinary, over 780,000 galaxies. Each one a glowing monument to time itself. Some appeared ancient, structured, and mature, even though they existed mere hundreds of millions of years after the supposed beginning of everything. If Hubble's deep field could fit upon a page, Webb's vision would fill an entire wall, a mural of infinity. Every dot, another galaxy. Every galaxy, another universe. It was not just an image. It was a revelation. A redefinition of what it means to exist. For the first time in history, humanity stood before the mirror of infinity. And yet, behind the awe and wonder, something unsettling began to emerge. The galaxies Webb captured were far too advanced for their time. They possessed order, structure, 
heavy elements that shouldn't have existed so soon after the dawn of time. By every model we've built, the early cosmos should have been chaos, a haze of gas clouds, newborn stars, and violent collisions. And yet, there they stood. Spiral galaxies, fully formed, majestic and ancient, their presence defying everything we thought we knew. They should not be there. But they are. This single discovery shook the foundations of modern cosmology. It suggests that star formation, black hole growth, and galactic structure began long before our timeline allows. The clock of creation, it seems, started ticking before the Big Bang. Or perhaps, time itself flows in ways we have never truly understood. The universe that refuses to end, for what Webb has captured is not merely ancient light, it is the echo of something deeper. Something that challenges the very idea of beginnings. As astronomers analyzed the data, another mystery began to unfold. The galaxies Webb revealed were not scattered randomly, like seeds thrown into the darkness. They were aligned. Connected. Bound together by invisible threads stretching across unimaginable distances. These filaments, vast rivers of matter, wove galaxies into a grand cosmic tapestry. This is what scientists now call the cosmic web. A network of dark matter and gas so immense that it binds galaxies into patterns vast enough to hold hundreds of thousands of Milky Ways. Some of these colossal structures stretch billions of light years across. Too perfect. Too symmetrical. Too deliberate to be accidents of chance. The universe, it seems, was not born in chaos. It was born with design, a pattern etched into the very fabric of space and time. Gravity alone cannot explain such order. Something deeper. Something more fundamental. Guides the geometry of existence itself. For decades, the Big Bang stood as our cornerstone. The single moment from which all of space, time, and matter were born. But Webb's discoveries whisper of something older. Something far more mysterious. If galaxies appeared mature so soon, then perhaps the universe didn't start once. Perhaps it has always been starting. An endless cycle of birth and rebirth. Expansion and collapse. Creation and renewal. Echoing through eternity like the heartbeat of existence itself. Some scientists now speak of a cyclic universe. Others imagine layered time, where past and future intertwine, and what we call, before, and, after, are merely illusions of perception. The deeper web looks, the more the universe refuses to end. What we once called the observable universe, a sphere 93 billion light years across, may be only a fragment of something far greater. There may be no edge. No boundary. No center. The cosmos could stretch infinitely in every direction, an endless ocean of light and shadow, repeating across forever. Infinity, once a poetic dream, has become a scientific reality. And in that infinity, we see ourselves reflected. Standing before Webb's images, humanity faces its greatest paradox. We have never felt smaller, and yet, we have never been more significant. Against the backdrop of countless galaxies, we are but a flicker of consciousness, on a fragile blue world, orbiting an ordinary star. And yet, we are the only known beings who have built a machine capable of looking back across billions of years, to capture the faint light of creation itself. In that act, we have become the universe beholding its own reflection. What Webb has given us is not merely a photograph, but a mirror. A mirror that reflects both our insignificance, and our brilliance. Its golden mirrors have peeled back the curtain of time, revealing that reality is deeper, stranger, and far more breathtaking than we ever imagined. The universe may have no beginning. No end. It may simply be. And as Webb continues to gaze into the infinite, 
Each pixel reveals galaxies upon galaxies, patterns beyond comprehension, and mysteries without end. Humanity now stands at the edge of something profound. The comfort of certainty has given way to the thrill of the unknown. The story of creation is being rewritten, and we are still on the first page. The James Webb Space Telescope was built to see the unseen. But what it has truly revealed, is our endless hunger to understand. Its discoveries remind us that knowledge is not an ending, but a doorway. And beyond that doorway lies something vast, timeless, eternal, and waiting. The universe is not only greater than we imagined, it is greater than we can